Yo, what is going on guys? And today, as you can tell by the title of the video and on screen, I'm going to be showing you some leaked information about Black Ops 3. So obviously, LEA and everyone was tweeting yesterday that at E3 people was creating these... I don't even know. It's obviously the weapons man o war. There's six attachments, which are just crazy to be honest. I never had that in any other Call of Duty. And it's called hashtag Black Ops 3 Paint Shop. So obviously that's gonna be a feature when the actual game comes out, so I can't wait for that. You can just imagine how many penises you're just gonna see on guns. God damn it, I can already see it coming. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, these are all the weapon names that have been leaked. This isn't confirmed or anything. We've got the AK-12, the HK416, the ACR, the Honey Badger, which I pray on anything that that's exact same as Call of Duty Ghost, because I won't die ever. The CM901, the Vepa, and the Scar L. Obviously, a lot of them, most people already know that they're from other Call of Duty, it's just renamed them somehow. But yeah, I'm looking forward to that. I'm more of a submachine gun player myself. They're coming up next right now. So, you can see the Scar PDW, the PDR, the MSBS, the MP7, the SM1, Max 11, UMP9, MSMC, the JS9, and the Bison. Obviously, a lot of these are also coming from Black Ops 2, Call of Duty Ghosts. So, yeah... If the MSBS is like, well, that was a pretty good gun in Call of Duty Ghosts. But yeah, the MP7, I'm looking forward to using that because that's going to be the exact same. The MSMC as well, that, that was just crazy. Black Ops 2. The shotguns are the RAS-12, the 612, the Saga-12. They love the word 12, don't they? The KSG from Black Ops 2, UTS-15, and the Origin-12. I'm not really sure. Obviously, the KSG was a slug round, so hopefully that's the exact same as Black Ops 2. I used to like using that weapon. Long range, just snapping people across them over a shotgun. It makes no sense, but it's always so fun to use like different weapons like that. Just What's the word? Different. There we go, just different. The LMG, or heavy weapons, are the M27 IRR, which is obviously from Call of Duty Ghosts. The RPK-12, P90, HBR, the Hammer the Strike, and the MK46. Obviously, I'm looking forward to the M27 because that was also from Call of Duty Ghost. Call of Duty Ghost is one of my favourite Call of Duty's if you didn't know that. I don't know why. Everyone hated it, but I just loved it, to be honest. My best Call of Duty ever. Now, next up, we have the Sniper Rivals. We have the Ballista from Black Ops 2, the SRS, the AX, the XLR, EVO. We also have the MR9AB. We also have the M408. Obviously, I'm not really a sniper rifle person to be honest, but I'm just hoping for all the snipers out there that they are one shot kill because it's so annoying in Advanced Warfare. You just you pretty much just be using I don't even know like a pistol or something. It's no damage. Talking about pistols, the M93, the G18, the SW500, the Rhino Warrior. MP1522, TAC15. The TAC15 was just overpowered in Black Ops 2, to be honest. That was just, uh, it was just like a two bullet kill. But yeah, obviously, pistols, Advanced Warfare, that was a massive letdown. The RW bomb was supposedly OP. Well, it was at the start until they patched it and made it absolutely terrible. But anyway, talking about Black Ops 3, I've got a pair of control freaks that I've been using recently. And obviously, I've said that once I hit 100,000 subscribers, I'm going to be giving them away on Twitter. So make sure that for a chance to win them, you hit that subscribe button, leave a like, follow me on Twitter, and if you want to get some no-scope glasses which protect you while you're playing games for a long period of time, then make sure you go and click the link in the description. And if you want to get your own custom controller, edit it pretty much like a scuff, but much better and cheaper, then make sure that you check out Kinch Gaming and use Rusty Fiver at checkout for 5% off. I hope you all enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe for future videos, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.